Rob Huff, um, it's race day today. How are you going to win the championship? Um, well, I don't want to tell you all my secrets, but I probably should because you'll probably help me. Uh, <laughs> well, I, uh, someday I want to be champion as well, so tell me. Exactly. What goes around comes around. Um, I don't know, you know, we're on, we're on pole, we're in a good position. Um, for me, really, I don't need to be racing anyone today. I've got to be thinking about the big, uh, the big picture, so I just need to make it through the first couple of turns and then um, see where we're placed. Uh, hopefully we'll be at the front. If it starts getting rough, I'll just sit back, wave them through and uh, follow them home. But uh, Because top three is okay, yeah? if you finish third, you're a champion. Yeah, if, uh, if Anand wins and I finish third, I'm champion. <laughs> Race one, I start from uh, P13. Um, in my country, it's uh, it's not really a lucky number, but in uh, China it is. So uh, let's see. Until now, I didn't see anything of it. But uh, the rolling start, uh, P13. Normally, it's in the middle of the pack. We're always, uh, yeah, the crashes uh, are supposed to start. So uh, I hope uh, I can wave uh, wave through those uh, difficulties and uh, see what happens after first lap. But uh, Lisboa, corner number three, is uh, most of the time uh, the, the difficult part, so uh, wait and see. Lab one, as is normal, one big chaos in Lisboa. Yeah, so maybe number 13 is a lucky number here in China. Uh, I had a small damage, so I was being very careful. Driving very slow, was nobody in front of me, nobody behind me. So, uh, yeah, P13 start, finish P6 is, uh, I think, uh, quite uh, quite all right. Uh, no, I feel uh, I feel very happy with, uh, with this result. Uh, let's see if we can do the race two, we can do at least the same. Two tactic is make good start. That's all, and uh, and uh, try to be as clever as in race one. I mean, uh, P13 is not the ideal position. As you saw, I was in the middle of the chaos, but I was also the one who was the first out of the chaos, and uh, yeah, so I was happy with this one. I have 
Somebody lose some parts and they hit my radiator, so I was losing the water. And then in the Mandarin corner, I was quite oversteered because I was uh, I was driving on my own water, so I was very slippery. But the temperature of the engine was going up, so I had to uh, I had to stop the car. It's a pity, but uh, that's the way it is. Amazing, speechless, absolutely amazing. Made it hard work for myself, but so pleased. Can't believe it, can't believe it. Well done, <laughs> Cheers, mate. Well done, boys. We are here at the prize giving ceremony of the FIA WTCC. But for the Dutch viewers, we had a special prize that was the steering wheel of the champion. Congratulations! And the champion is Robert Huff. Robert, um, you've got something for me. Got a little present. It's not for you, Tommy, although I am going to give it to you. But I'm, going to hope, I'm hoping you're going to pass my 2012 championship winning steering wheel yes. out of my Chevrolet Cruze to a very lucky guy called... Can I have it? Yeah, really? No. Why? I'll fight you for it. I know. I will give it. You sure? <laughs>